Hey, what's up guys? My name is Rocky Rocket and welcome to this reaction video to the legendary ending and then the Halo 4 terminals, which should fill us in on what the hell the Didact was doing because uh, the story didn't want to touch on that much. Now, here's a little bit of my review for Halo 4. I thought it was great, but I think it focuses a little bit too much on Chief on Cortana and leaves the Didact and humanity being at risk in the back. In the back somewhere. They, yeah, it's not really that important. It's more about Chief and Cortana. Um, we saw Halsey at the beginning of the game. Didn't see her at the end. <laughs> so I was like, I was left at the end going, where was Dr. Halsey in all of this? I mean, I saw her with cuffs on, so maybe that links into Halo 5. Probably. Maybe. Maybe they were setting up a, a longer story. Um... But yeah, uh, uh, so we're going to find out what the didact, what, what his motivations were. Because I, hear, I heard him talking a lot, but I didn't get any context because we were focused on, you know, the relationship between Chief and Cortana, which I liked, by the way. I liked that they had some form of like, they, they were basically dreading the end, the end of their relationship. Uh, Chief's going to be empty headed because he's not going to lovely voice in his ear anymore um either way gonna watch the legendary ending we're all gonna have to watch that sad bit again and um and then we'll watch the the terminals so i i'll shut up and press the button Me art. I've seen this before. It's almost like I've played it. Is, is there also gameplay? Gameplay. I know. Quick time event. It still felt good to me. We can all have our opinions. Mine is. It was fun. You Ninety percent of it. Your own. Resolution, what is this resolution? <laughs> oh, he's cool. So misguided. Imagine going through legendary and just being held up in the air like that. You're like, I did all this for this. Come on, man. Let me win. Humanity's imprisonment is a kindness. Is it? Your face is not a kindness. Your face is disgusting. You should go get that looked at and reconstructed. Maybe he does. Maybe he's not dead. Maybe he's just different now. Oh, it's the ladies of the ship. They've come to fuck you up, buddy. In that case, you won't mind if you return the favor. God, you're loud. for mankind is misplaced. I'm not doing this for mankind. She's doing it for her man. <laughs> they didn't add that line. I did, and it's disgusting. Um, yeah. So, more flaws. You might, you want them, so I'm gonna say it. Prometheans, not enough enemy variety. I said it. There we go. Promethean weapons, not enough variety. What a lovely view. Light rifle, loved it. Binary rifle, loved it. But them two looked very similar. Hi. No, oh, bye. What? Oh, yeah. See? That hurt, didn't it? So people have told me that the Didact didn't die there. Uh, Chief trapped him in a comic book. I don't know. Make it, Chief. And supposedly, what saves him is Cortana wrapping him in the light bridge. In like a bubble. 
Seems like a good idea. Where does the energy source come from, though? Get ready for sadness. Hey. Cortana. Cortana, do you read? She reads fine. Cortana, come in. So I wonder what's different about it, because so far everything's been exactly the same. How? Oh, I'm the strangest thing you've seen all day. But if we're here... It worked. You did it. Just like you always do. So how do we get out of here? I'm not coming with you this time. What? Most of me is down there. I only held enough back to get you off the ship. No. That's not... We go together. It's already done. I am not leaving you here. John. I've waited so long to do that. It was my job to take care of you. We were supposed to take care of each other. And let's not pretend it was the job, John. Cortana, please. Wait. Okay. And his world comes crashing down around him, like the visuals indicate. So, yeah, I like the uh, the humanization of uh, John. You know. Some people don't really like it. They kind of like him to be the strong, silent type. I kind of like that he uh, spoke more. Hello? Show me more stuff. I got an achievement. I'm continuing to get more of them. Somehow. Well done. Whomever you are, I should credit you. Wait. We'll... When this is finished, I'll credit you. You did this. You're the man. Or girl. Or woman, or whatever. You did it. Good shot. Used it for the thumbnail. <laughs> everybody knows. Because everybody watched. Nobody need to man their battle stations or No? Alright. You should probably man your battle. No. Lasky's gonna ask him if he's a machine or not. I know that's not what he says, but he indicates that he might be thinking a little bit too mechanically. Mind if I join you? No, go away. Of course end not, of, sir. End of cutscene. <laughs> At ease, Chief. 
Feels kind of odd for you to call me sir. Beautiful, isn't she? I don't get to see her often enough. I grew up in New Harmony. Attended Corbulo Military Academy. Never saw Earth in person until I was an adult, but... I still think of her as home. You don't talk much, do you? Chief, I won't pretend to know how you feel. I've lost people I care about, but... Never anything like you're going through. You say Cortana is kind of like his handler, right? soldiers is to protect humanity. Whatever the cost. Sure, like an assistant, but she was more his handler. <laughs> you say that like soldiers and humanity are two different things. I mean, soldiers aren't machines. We're just people. Yeah, but they humanized uh, Chief in this one. I'll, I, I kind of like that. But as I said, it overshadowed everything to do with Earth. We didn't even see any consequences of them getting hit by that uh, composer. We did. We didn't see any. Did we shoot? Did we cut to a shot on Earth where everyone's turning into she that, said that to me once. spark? About being a machine. You get it yet? But yeah, um. It was kind of null, you know, the uh, the conflict. But, as I said, I, I enjoyed the focus on the relationship. I don't feel like I fought the Covenant a lot either. I feel like they were just there to distract us from the Prometheans sh showing up. Hey! Whoa! Where's me? That dude! Hey, stop! There we go. You did it. You edited it. You. You did that. In this hour of victory, it's the didact. It's only defeat. I ask why. We are foreigners, guardians of all that exists. The roots of the galaxy have grown deep under our careful tending. Where there is life, the wisdom of our countless generations has saturated the soil. Our strength is a luminous sun towards which all intelligence blossoms and the impervious shelter beneath which it has prospered. I stand before you, accused of the sin of ensuring foreigner ascendancy, of attempting to save us from this fate where we are forced to receive. He's got a good, go good voice, though. ...as the greatest threat in the galaxy. Uh, how Refusing rude. ...to eradicate them is a fool's gambit. We squander eons in the darkness while they seize our triumphs for their own. The mantle of responsibility for all things belongs to foreigners alone. I see no difference. Did I watch that for nothing? Think of my axe as you will. But do not doubt the reality. Don't tell me I'm going to see his face. The reclamation has already begun. And we are hopeless to stop it. Has already begun. Oh my god. God, he's a demon. How old is he here? He's got scars, which he should have. His eyes are black. John's fucking terrified. Put the mask back on. Jesus. And we are hopeless to stop it. Yes, you are. 
A man with that kind of stare? You don't want to get in his way. It's like he'll eat your soul. Anyway, that was the Halo 4 ending by AM Harbinger. Thank you, sir. You got 50k. Good for you. That's awesome. Right. Yeah, I made my own little list. Halo videos. Just so I could, you know, it's the ease. So now we're going to watch the uh, the Terminals. Um, very interested now because I, I want context. Give me context. What was the Didact up to? Didact. Oh, yes. Oh, oh, yes. Oh, we're still on that, are we? No. Here we go. Enemies move deeper into our territory with abandon. They must be eradicated. Who is it? Who Shall we take revenge? Abandon the mantle and all that its philosophy has given us these thousand generations. All our plans have been torn asunder. More reason not to abandon our beliefs. The mantle is our guidepost in times such as these. We must not falter in following its teachings. The enemy must be sent home. Now the we to stand with the galaxy, rather than rail against us and take what they desire. The mantle shelters all. Didact. Right, so some of them are wrong. I'm going to turn that off. That, that bugs me when the auto subtitles just... My, supposedly, according to YouTube's auto subtitles, my name is uh, Rocky Rocket, or otherwise known as Ricky Rocket, like I'm a 90s cartoon. Thanks, YouTube, um, and all the people uh, watching this who were born uh, in the late 90s are like, what's a 90s cartoon like? Shut up. Shut up. You make a fair, if uncomfortable, point. You have my support. Librarian, will you likewise follow the mantle as the Didac suggests? Why has he got a keyhole in his yes, face? Master Builder. Lego movie? What? So, um, this one's called War. I'm assuming that they're talking about humanity coming into their territory and they will make uh, eradicate them uh, before, you know, they s squat in their home. You're not angry at me. You're a lot more handsome now. We had this discussion a century ago. If still revolting oh. looking. So you are angry at me? In the chambers, yes. But not now. You'll depart for Requiem soon? At dawn. My Prometheans are already there. Already there? You knew the Master Builder would side with you. Should we step back inside the Council Chamber? No. I would rather we spend our night out here. There will be fighting enough in the days ahead. <laughs> okay. Ah! Jesus Christ! Just fucking throw yourself at me. God damn it. Uh, okay, so this is Lord of Admirals. Um, so he, he Didact was already set up at Requiem. I'm wondering what Requiem... Oh, Requiem's for holding the composer, right? Yes. My love, put fear from your heart. War is your realm, Didact, not mine. And you march to this war, facing foes that, while always aggressive, were never so aggressive as they are now. Your fears are unfounded. The enemy will be turned, and I shall stand by your side once more. Promise me that. I promise you. You're a liar! Nothing will stand between us. They look like 
some really highly technological... Lord of Admirals. Oh. We are in position over the Forerunner planet. Show me. Population numbering over 2 billion. Forerunner ships on alert and in battle. Okay. Ancient humans? Is it possible? Have we gotten yes. ahead of it? Flood infestation detected, my lord. Damn it! My lord, the infestation is in a remote locale. Perhaps if we warn the Forerunners? If, if we warn them, we give the Flood time to spread. You know we have no choice. Oh. Cleanse the planet. Hold on. Are the humans doing what the Forerunner Forerunners do? So the Forerunners built the Halos to eradicate all of the Flood's food source so they all die out? Or they can't spread? You know, because everything just gets obliterated? The, the, <laughs> is that what the humans are doing? They're just like doing it the long way? Going on a ship from planet to planet just eradicating them in order to stop the Flood? That's an interesting thought. Probably wrong, but don't yell at me. Whoops. Charum Hakor. I'm sure that's how that's pronounced, definitely. The humans Ooh, actually threaten the galaxy, yet we have treated them as the mantle required. Their punishment is just. Justice is reducing their genetics in such short generations from a space-bearing race to... this? They are closer now to the animals they behaved as. Oh! Very nice. Very cool. It's the Didax fault we're all fucking idiots. If not for their encounter with the Flood, their gene plan could have surpassed our own. They could have someday held the mantle of responsibility. The humans were not meant to protect others. The mantle of responsibility for all things is ours, and ours alone. I see. We we might have been doing something noble, but he thinks we're be being evil bastards. Um, and yet he's being a proper egotistical, maniacal thing. <laughs> by the mantle is ours we we have it we're the noble ones not them let's turn them into just beyond apes good yes the mantle is ours and we hold it so tight that even in death we shall hold it still here comes the flood That's some nice armor. That's some dead people. Oh, nice noises. Nope, missed you. Nope. Maybe the flood will return. Ah! Waypoint. Flood. Okay, so this is Lord an elder. Lord of Admirals. Oh. So very many years have we battled. Finest opponents. The mantle accepts all who live fiercely, who defend their young, build, and struggle. Help them grow. Ooh. I like this one. And even those who dominate, as humans have dominated, cruelly and without wisdom. For all of us, there is a time like this. And for you, that time is now. I think I Remember saw this, this one. Relentless enemy, killer of our children, Lord of Admirals.
Soon we will face the enemy you have faced. And we are afraid. Mm. My life workers are investigating, but I believe the humans were never attacking us. Tell that to the millions of dead. The humans were acting as caretakers, pruning away planets so that this infection would not spread. They took the mantle of responsibility upon themselves, and in so doing, they brought this sickness to our shores. Husband. He's very up his own ass, isn't he? I mean... He's very powerful, so I get it. Knights. So yeah, I saw that one during the gameplay, the and then never looked for another uh, another terminal, just because I was like, well, that confused me. Great. The flood cover more of our galaxy with each passing day. They feast on the essence of life itself. The only way to stop their advance is to remove that life upon which they feast. Like what the humans My are trying to do, yeah. have made plans for the receding of humanity and of all life after the Halos are fired. Wow. So you agree the Halos are our only solution? I do. And your husband? My husband has a different opinion of what steps to take against the flood. Hmm, I bet he does. Fight them with Domestos. Did it work? 99% of Run bacteria dead. The procedure is a failure. I am still susceptible to flood infection. That leaves only the composer. It will not work on my new form. Then you will lead us, as always. You would submit to such sacrifice. Didact, if the Composer is our final hope to defeat the Flood, no Promethean would resist. I have led you, my Prometheans, for thousands of years. And I shall continue to lead you. Rise! Rise and protect the Forerunners! Rise and protect the galaxy! I mean, they're doing it for nice reasons. But they're very loud. Justice. And all of this music has gotten this video copyright claimed. So I'm kind of 50-50 on the whole Promethean design, by the way. They they look great in the in the mask. Uh the the one that the Dynact was just talking to with the awesome helmet. Kind of like that stuff. But um the beetle back, you know, and the fact they don't fly is weird, you know, because the things they just open up and let out some other thing that flies around. Bit of a weird choice. Uh, and, you know, they teleport, which is whew, kind of a pain in the dick to try and fight. But, you know, after you get down their patterns, they're all right. They're not bad. They take a little bit of getting used to. I just wish there was more variety in them. You know, I think the variety was supposed to come from some of them have got spikes. It's like, well, that's not really enough to make them seem different. It took me a long time to realize that that one's spiky. That one's not. What? What's the deal? What? Uh, I think I think one of them was orange at one point as well, and I was like, "Oh, so you carry the heavy firepower? That guy's probably in charge because he's got spikes. I guess that's how you measure a rank. And then he's just fodder. They still all acted exactly the same. The flood is 
is still too strong. By that I mean I I killed them all. Yes, that's how, that's what I meant. Perhaps if I had greater numbers. There they are. Humans. Hi. Your kind brought the flood to our shores. Oh, now wow. you will aid in endless threat. Wow, thanks. And then they... What does the composer do? They... <clears throat> does it digitize all, all, all of them? I don't remember. Like collect some as data. Someone fill me in. I I don't I really don't remember. They didn't really specify that much. They just went, this thing's bad or good, depending on how you use it, but we're gonna use it to kill you. So uh, look, oh, they're having relationship issues. <laughs> That's kind of how it felt. <laughs> I ensured they would rise once more, better than before. Your pets have a noble purpose ahead of them. You do not face me in person after your deceit. I have an army to build from the raw materials harvested this day. Ah. The citizens of this halo are my first conscripts. And with them in my thrall, the Flood will meet its defeat. Yes. Humanity's loss of biological form will serve as final payment for their crimes. It is a kindness they do not deserve. What will be done? Move the other humans to safety. Ensure the security of their index samples. They must finish what we have failed to do. Hey, that My guy looks pretty cool. Where are you going? Stop my husband's madness. She's cool. I like her. Cryptum? Cryptum. Don't know what that is. Cryptum. My dear husband. Oh, we're writing a I dear John Lair. Okay. And I have found forgiveness. I know your reasons. I understand them. I know you. Perhaps better than you could ever hope to know yourself. Uh -oh. I ask you, forgive my transgressions. Like yourself, all I have done. Well, um, uh, wow. Uh, I have done for the greater good. The greater good. What's that from? Our time as the galaxy's caretakers Good. is past. The Flood have overrun us. In the days to come, the Halo Rings will fire, eradicating the Flood. And all other life, for a time. I have worked hard to index all species in known space. When the time comes, these indexes will open. And once more, the galaxy will breathe and grow. Blood will pump. Life will claw its way out of the oceans and through the mud. Babes will be born. And grow old under the warmth of a thousand suns. Awesome. I like her ideas. Civilizations will rise in our stead, and our job as caretakers will at last bear fruit. Until then, I leave you here, my love. The only living thing in this galaxy, sealed safely away. Why didn't you just spend these ages ahead of you in meditation on your choices? When you wake, you will find the humans. I have ensured that they will grow strong and vibrant. They will be our rightful heirs. Their gene plan dictates that the galaxy will be theirs to care for by then. I beg of you, find the strength to help them learn from our mistakes. 
and my husband. Let them teach you as well. Please. Why not just have him eviscerated like the rest of you? Questions? Why kill everyone and then keep him alive? When he's that dangerous? She gave us life, but then she condemned us. Mixed signals, I'm getting mixed signals, right? I believe you. Right, so, those were the, uh, that was a legendary ending with the terrifying, I want to forget that. And, um, the Terminals, which were actually pretty damn good story. Um, had I known where they were during the game, I would have liked to have collected them. But now I have a little bit more insight as to what he was up to and why he was doing the things that he was doing. His, his perspective was that we brought the Flood to the forerunners and uh he wanted to stomp us out and stomp the flood out and uh, it didn't go that way um sh uh, the librarian saved us you know and uh they, you know and then left him alive everyone else was gonna die but she left him alive why to think about what he had done <laughs> it sounds like something you do to a child get over there stand over there and think about what you've done for thousands, if not millions of years, stay over there and think about what you've done. And then, you know, when someone lets you out and you haven't learned your lesson, try and destroy everyone all over again. Wow. <laughs> right, guys. So that is all I've got time for for this video. I, I am going to check now and see if Cyberpunk 2077 has uh, downloaded. Some beautiful subscriber uh, and member to the YouTube channel, uh, CMG. Oh, wait a minute. I can, uh, CMG, Bot bottom left, just under four, that man bought me Cyberpunk 2077, and uh, I now have to make a decision, am I going to stream it or not, so you'll see that when this video is up, uh, but thank you very much for watching, I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, please leave a like, comment, subscribe, look after yourselves, and I will see you in the next one, bye.